Saw 11 has officially been delayed by an entire year. We can now expect it on September the 26th, 2025. No! No! Yes, we can't believe it. Just uh, very shortly after posting our video about whether or not Saw 11 was going to be delayed. The perfect timing, by the way. <laughs> they just so happened to officially announce that it is actually delayed by an entire year. Not a few months, not until maybe six months, but a full 12 months from when it was supposed to come out. And all the defending we did about it not being delayed in that video meant nothing. It has unfortunately been delayed. Billy delivered the news. The clock is ticking. Will you play my waiting game? And unfortunately, it was delivered to me just as I was about to start work. So I was pretty miserable all day. Yeah, it, it was uh, Australian time for us. It, the news actually came through on Instagram. We first saw it. Uh, we saw it very quickly after it was posted. Mm. At first, when I was watching the video, Billy on the screen, I thought, this is great. We haven't had an update yep. for a little while. And then he starts saying that he needs a little bit more time. I'm like, okay, maybe a little bit of a delay. And then they post the date a year later. Yeah. And you're kind of like, am I reading it wrong? I couldn't read it, Prickers, yeah. because it was American date and I was freaking out. But when I realized it was a full year delay, it just took a moment to settle in. But it's... It, it's it's bad news. It's terrible news. It's terrible, terrible news. It's yeah. funny because when I was watching the video, I jumped the gun and I sent it to you yes. and go, ha, 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 yes. <laughs> because as he was talking, I'm like, oh, it means he's announcing that it's coming out on the date that they said because I would just got through the start of the video. And then I'll start watching further and further. And I'm like, oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> and, yeah, having that date come through and being an entire year later, you could have never guessed it. I I could have assumed or maybe guessed that it was going to be delayed by a couple of months, yeah. but an entire year. An entire year. It's it's insane. I yes. mean, look, a lot of people are saying that we can look at it in the best light possible, being that they are going to really perfect this film and they're going to uh, take their time writing the story, which I do appreciate. But for someone who loves horror as much as we do, specifically Saw, this was something that was kind of like on our minds all the time. So September couldn't have come any quicker. And now it's like 533 days that we have to <laughs> Don't wait count the days. until really this movie comes out. Like it's just, it's crazy. For crazy. us and like a lot of you guys watching at home, Saw 11's release at the end of this year was a big part of our year. It was something we were all looking forward to. Uh, I know a lot of people had even arranged plans around Saw 11's release date. And so for that change to come is obviously bad news and it's depressing. We can look at it in two ways. Uh, we can be depressed about it and we can be sad that it's going to be now a much longer wait than we originally planned. Or we can be positive about the fact that they're not rushing the movie and mm -hmm. that they're actually going to have time now to really flesh it out, do it right, maybe bring back some more uh, older actors. Yeah. And there's a few other things that they can also do with it. And we will go over those things in this video. We obviously just wanted to open it with our disdain for the fact that it has been delayed. We don't want to harp on, harp on about it too much. Mm -hmm. um, but obviously, yes, we are disappointed. Um, that's why you guys are here. You wanted to hear we're us. We're disappointed, disappointed, but we're remaining hopeful. Very very hopeful, like you said, yeah. um, that they are going to give us something fantastic, maybe potentially even better than Saw 10. Um, what I will say that Adam and I have a little bit of a theory about is the idea that they could possibly be filming Saw 11 and Saw 12 uh, in the, at the same time. In tandem or at least creating them together. At least, yeah, creating and writing the story to coincide with each other that's so that right. it does work a little bit better. And that's probably the biggest thing that I can take away from this. In the hope they're giving them this extra year, they can really craft Saw 12 to really fit well with Saw 11 because the rumours, if you haven't been watching any videos, the rumours have been for a very long time that a Saw 11 and 12 are both really in production. Yeah. And the idea is that they kind of really know what they want to do for both of those movies. Mm -hmm. So with this extra time that they've really given themselves, they should be able to make the two work really well, possibly shoot the two at the same time, or at least write both the scripts together so we do get at least a really fantastic maybe end credit scene, cliffhanger, what have you for Saw 11, mm -hmm. uh, and really, really connect the dots fantastically. And that's what I'm really probably excited about the most. Yeah, I think ideally that's sort of what I'm hanging on to, yeah. the idea that they are, if not filming them both coinciding with each other, maybe at least creating the script for Saw 12 at the same time. Same time. And at least that also gives us a little bit of hope in the sense that if Saw 11 is coming... Well, 
we know Saw 11 is coming out uh, two years after Saw 10. Maybe Saw 12 will go back to that year mark and they'll they'll yes. have a script already put together. They won't need to worry about writing anything or, you know, tweaking anything to get it right. Uh, it seems way more likely that Saw 12 could possibly come out a That's year That's right. This Saw extra 11. year should put them in a really good place so when 11 does finally come out in 2025, that Saw 12 is ready to go. They're mm. not scrambling. They're not sort of rushing to get it ready. Saw 12 should be pretty much all written script-wise, all prepared. They know exactly where they're going with it. Saw 11 comes out, and Saw 12 is a nice and smooth, easy 12-month release later. So in the very least, maybe if 11 had come out this year, we could have possibly been waiting longer for Saw 12. Yeah, exactly. Because they would have been behind. At least maybe this pretty much guarantees us Saw 12 is only a year after 11. And fingers if the crossed. Yeah, fingers <laughs> crossed, of course. But if the plans are correct or the rumors are correct... Um, I believe Saw 12 really will connect to 11 in some way. Yeah. Um, so it kind of makes sense that they'd make the two together, at least write the scripts together. Um, and I think we can really expect something special with at least 11's end and 12 connecting to that really well. Yeah, I, I definitely believe that 11's end will connect to Saw 12 in some way, shape, or yeah. form, whether that be a flash forward to the future or whatnot. And you will actually see more of that discussion in our next <laughs> video, which will be chatting about everything we hope for yes. in Saw 11. We're gonna be, uh, which we video. originally uh, <laughs> were excited about it being much sooner, but <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> it's not the case. Now, there is no official reasoning behind the delay as well. We will touch on uh, when Saw did announce the delay, which I'm sure most of you have seen the official announcement from Saw's post. They kind of really gave a kind of, let's say, bullshit excuse. They definitely did. It um, was more just like I can understand it from a marketing point of yeah. view. Uh, that's sort of what they've done. Like the whole marketing perspective for Saw 10 was Billy yeah. and Billy talking to its his audience. That's right. Um but I really would have appreciated an official statement from either Mark Berg, Oren Coles, Kevin Gruter, even Tobin Bell for that matter. One of the producers or the director, it would have been nice to maybe come forward and say, hey guys, we know you're really excited. Mm -hmm. Sorry, Saw 11 has been pushed back. Mm -hmm. Maybe a small reasoning about why. Mm -hmm. um, having Billy just roll out and be like, oh, I just got to get those traps better. Got to yeah. get a bit of time to prepare those traps. It's cute, you know, stuff like that. But we yeah. want we want a sort of more sincere reason. Maybe I think it. maybe Lionsgate, there, there must be something going on with their funding or something along those One lines. One of the rumours yep. was that, that Lionsgate had decided to film or spend their time filming something else instead and yep. they actually put their time and effort into a different movie. Which is very interesting because you look at things like The Crow that was delayed as well. There was another film that they had that was supposed to start filming or something that was delayed too. I couldn't tell you what it was. Um, um, but these are, they're not small films. Like The Crow yeah. is a highly anticipated film, although I don't think it looks very good. No. It is a very highly anticipated film along with Saw 11. So it's interesting that they would decide to push it back, but it's whatever. We just have to deal with it now. There's no sense in complaining about it. This will probably be the last you hear about it from us because we just yes. want to think happy thoughts That's when it comes right. to Saw 11. Yeah. We're not here to necessarily complain. We don't want to be negative people or anything like that, but I think uh, especially for the guys who do watch us at home, I'm sure you all expected us to have a bit of a reaction to this delay. Uh, you know that we didn't want to hear of a delay. We didn't want this to happen. We hope for the best. But we did worry that there was a... There was a small chance. There was a chance. And there was rumors going around that we didn't want to believe. But the worry was always there that this might happen. Of course, now that it's happened... Um, we had no no uh, other choice but to sit down and record this video to have a reaction to the official delay. So definitely drop uh, your ideas on this down below. And, and for the meantime, there is 10 other Saw films <laughs> that you can familiarize yourself with, even become an expert in like we have decided to. Uh, there's yeah. no shortage of Saw content. So Look, guys, um, thanks for watching as always, and uh, we'll see you in the next video. We'll see you next time, guys. Game over.